Hi there, I'm Michael with eTrailer.com. Today we're going to take a quick look at this Kurt T Connector vehicle wiring harness with a four pole flat trailer connector. This is going to provide a four way flat trailer connector at the back of your vehicle so that you can power up your trailer's signal lights. Uh, this is going to be compatible with five pole, six pole, and seven pole adapters, which are sold separately. So if your trailer uses um, any of those kinds, uh, five pole, six pole, or seven pole, um, plug, you can adapt this uh, to use with your trailer so that the lights will function properly and correspond with your vehicle's lights. This is a custom fit kit. It is designed for your 2022 and newer Ford Maverick. Um, because this is designed specifically for your Ford Maverick, it's going to be very simple to get installed. Uh, this will plug right into your vehicle's wiring uh, right behind your tail lights. So I'll go over um, in more detail how it's installed here in a moment, um, but it is going to be very simple for you since it is a custom fit. This does have a tail light converter that's going to ensure that your vehicle's wiring matches that of your trailer, so you're not going to have to worry about uh, compatibility. It's going to ensure that everything's working properly. Uh, the powered module is going to connect to your battery to avoid overloading your vehicle's electrical system. Uh, so um, rather than putting more strain on your vehicle's wiring, it'll connect to the battery so it's getting all the power that it needs. This is gonna provide five amps per circuit for your stop and turn lights and 7.5 amps per circuit for your tail lights. Uh, as far as the installation goes, they do include very detailed instructions to walk you through that process, uh, getting it installed. But just a very simple overview and these are going to plug in right behind your uh, tail lights. So you'll uh, remove your tail lights, find the uh, factory plugs that look very similar to these. They're already plugged in together. You'll unplug those, put this in line. That's going to then recomplete that circuit so your vehicle's tail lights will work uh, just like normal. You won't have to uh, worry about any. Uh, issues and uh, functionality there, um, but then it will also send that signal out to your trailer. Uh, so your uh, yellow side is going to be on your driver's side, your green side is going to be on your passenger side, so you'll route that over to your passenger side. Uh, you will have this ring terminal on the white wire that's going to be your ground, so they include a self-tapping screw there, so you can just uh, ground that to some solid metal. And then you're going to have uh, your black wire, which is going up to your battery. They do include uh, plenty of wire here to uh, route that up. So you'll use one of the included butt connectors to uh, get that crimped in place. And then the other end will go on your wiring. Then you'll route this up uh, to your battery. Uh, they do include a diagram here to help you um, get that routed up. But you just want to make sure you're staying away from anything hot or moving that could potentially damage the wire. They do include some zip ties here so that you can uh, keep this up out, out of the way, off the ground. Once you get up to your battery compartment, then you'll put another butt connector on the other end. And on the other side of the butt connector, you'll connect your fuse harness here. So you get that plugged in, uh, put in place. The other side of the uh, fuse harness is going to go into this other ring terminal, which will then uh, get mounted onto the positive post on your battery. And then uh, once everything's uh, set up and complete, you can put the fuse in there and you'll be ready to go. They also include this uh, double-sided tape so that you can mount this unit uh, back there behind your taillights wherever it will fit. And then your four-pole uh, trailer connector uh, can just be zip-tied uh, to uh, your hitch near your hitch receiver so that it's uh, ready for you to plug in your trailer. They do include this little dust cap uh, so that you can protect your connections from dirt and debris and that sort of thing as it's going to be living outside uh, of your trailer or your uh, truck. So overall, very simple installation, especially with these uh, plug and play uh, plugs there. So you're not going to have to worry about uh, splicing into your vehicle's wiring, potentially um, you know, voiding your warranty and that sort of thing. And so it is going to be a, a pretty straightforward installation, especially since it is a, a custom uh, fit for your vehicle. So if you are wanting to add uh, wiring so that you can get your trailers, lights functioning properly. This is going to be a great kit for you. That completes our look for today. Again, I'm Michael with eTrailer.com. Thanks for watching.